<clears throat> oh, really? What's up, guys? It's your pal Malin, and today I, uh, I'm going to be real honest with you. What I want to do is shoot a video so that I have an excuse to play with the color grading. I'm, I saw some cool YouTube videos lately. I want to try some of them out. So do something uh, a little different, film a little bit of my day, and I'm going to show you today some things that I have received in the mail. So here we go. Here's the first thing I got. We're gonna get a little personal here and I'm gonna show you men's underwear. I found this uh, underwear not too long ago called Mass 21 and I love them. They're thin, boxer briefs, air goes right through them. They're dope. For some reason, the company, when you order these, they send you a, an individual Ziploc baggie for each pair of underwear. Came with four, uh, all different colors. They each came in their, um, their own Ziploc baggie. But if you're a dude and you want to try some thin, airy underwear, these are where it's at. Um, mine are a medium. And yeah, it's called Mass 21. Hey, so the next thing I got, uh, totally different, but it's also uh, kind of a clothing wear, but check this out. This is a little secret that uh, I think I've mentioned on the channel before to you guys, but this is how I save lots of time at the airport in the mornings. Every day when I put on my shoes, I save uh, probably 30 seconds or a minute, however long it takes you to tie your shoes with these little guys. They're called hickeys and they'll change your life. I started buying them because I was sick of taking my shoes off and tying them and untying them at the airport. So to solve that problem, I started wearing slip-ons, which I don't like wearing either. So I ended up combining the two and I turned all of my tennis shoes into slip-ons. These little hickeys, they're just these little plastic pieces. They go in your shoes and they replace your shoelaces. Might seem kind of weird, but once you do it, you will never wear shoelaces again, I can almost guarantee you. Here's what they look like on the shoes. And the third and final thing I wanna show you guys is something that you might actually be responsible for. And I say that because I received something in the mail and I have no idea who sent it to me or why, but I think it was very uh, sweet and thoughtful. Check this out. Someone sent me a package anonymously with books. I've got three books. Power of Now, Love Yourself, and Letting Go. I've read The Power of Now, but I've not read the other two, so I'm definitely going to check them out. Um, I don't know who sent me these, but this is one of the funny things about turning a camera on and having an email list and a blog is I get little gifts from people all the time, like right behind me. This is actually from my sister. This magnet says never, never, never give up. But then this one, it's never too late to be who you might have been. Now this is something I say and talk about all the time. And I got that randomly from someone who reads the blog and watches the YouTube channel. Um, and I still have it to this day. Another thing, I've got coffee cups that people have sent me. And now I have these books, man, Power of Now. I read this probably eight years ago, nine years ago when I first got sober. And uh, great book. I might reread re it. This one I've never seen before. It's called Love Yourself with a Guy Shooting Himself in the Head. So if you've paid attention to my channel over the years, this fits me perfectly. It's called Love Yourself Like Your Life Depends on It by Kamal Rivikant. Rivikant. If you've heard of this book, give me a, a quick review in the uh, comments because I've never heard of it. One of the most important books I've read this year, a quote by James Altucher, who if you've never heard of him, go read his blog, jamesaltucher.com. Pretty cool. Pretty crazy. 
Um, yeah, and what's the other? Letting Go, The Pathway of Surrender by David R. Hawkins, who was director of the Institute for Spiritual Research, founder of Path of Devotional Non-Duality, pioneering researcher in the field of consciousness, author, lecturer, cl clinician, all that stuff. Haven't read this one. I don't think I've ever even heard of it. So if you have anything to say about this book, if you've read any of these books, Letting Go, Love Yourself, or The Power of Now, let me know what you think. truth is whoever took the time to send this little package to me thank you I appreciate it like I didn't I don't ask you guys for stuff I don't necessarily like receiving stuff you know white shoes but look uh, I, everybody loves getting a gift and I'm I agree mmm so that's what's in the mail hope you're having a beautiful day I'm gonna play with the, some video editing today, so I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. And as always, have a great day, and I will coffee see you in the future.